Moros. Please speak of me and explain what has come to pass. Yet more deviation from the plan. All was to arrive with the key, bringing the perfected genetic code. JC was to awaken to greet the new age. Instead, that woman came, followed soon after by the hateful ones. Where is Paul? What is going on? I'll bet that your intruders are Billy Adams along with some Templar backup. After that, I have no idea what you're talking about. When JC arrived so many years ago, and the Versalite base fell silent, he took care of us. In return, we would maintain his habitat while he slept, and await a also go as masterpiece. Paul was to accompany the key, but instead two keys have arrived, and Paul remains nowhere. So where are the keys? The gate must use some sort of DNA fingerprinting, and since both Billy and I have Denton genetic code, we were able to use it. It was never about the training, was it? They were just perfecting the DNA. And the gate has only brought us destruction. The hateful ones threaten capture and murder us. We can neither fulfill our duties to JC, nor can we get to his habitat to awaken him. Why would the Templars bother with capture? I hate to be so blunt, but it seems that elimination would make more sense. It is not clear. It seems they are trying to learn more about us, but in gravely vicious ways. Right now, there is one of our number in captivity. If you could help him reach this location, it would mean a great deal to us. I'm not too keen on helping the Greys, but on the other hand, I do need allies here. Camp layout. Okay, this should be a map. Why do I need the image of a helicopter still here? Why can't I go to the 8th one? Ah. Okay, entrance to Chasey Central. Tent 4, Black Gate, Arrival Cell Portal. The abandoned first light. Mm. Mm. Increased range. Maybe it's something that would be useful on what weapon? Maybe flamethrower? Perhaps you fear that you will inadvertently do the bidding of the Illuminati. Have patience. Nothing will be the same once you have revived JC Dent. Welcome to Antarctica, JC's sanctuary for 20 years. How? Why a secret base on Antarctica? Well, pointless details, we'll ignore that for now. Why do you persist? Tong, Dumier, Her Holiness, they're all fools. Do you really understand what they're asking you to do? Go to 1004 and I'll contact you there. There's some kind of a uh, weird creature here. Hey, and hostile robots. Hint of four, what is that? So it's somewhere here. South, south of this location, one of these, low. I want to hear her explanation 
She's murdering sentient beings left and right, murdering entire cities, so what could possibly warrant all that? people otherwise we'll get spotted Climbing speed was again of the slow variety, so there's no way in hell we can make it up there before the droid, before the robot turns around. much much faster so what the hell is going on yeah I think we're safe don't drop down go exactly what they've all told you, but you're just a pawn, and reviving an ancient mad cyborg isn't going to help anyone. And you found that the Templars are a sane and reasonable employer? Lesser of the evils offered at this point. The other entities all want you to revive the man responsible for the collapse. What good can that possibly accomplish? Apostle Corps wants to worship him, and the Illuminati wants to try to control him. And what would you propose? The only safe way to deal with such dangerous power and such an unstable individual is to destroy him. It's the only way. That's an interesting viewpoint, especially considering JC's work made us both what we are today. That hardly matters in the grand scheme of things. You can try, but you're not going to be able to stop me from repurposing the Helios core for more beneficial purposes. Like what? She's not really telling us anything. It's there's all sort of possibilities. But what at least has been directly said or implied that she was sort of part of, of the Templars already at the point where this, they destroyed the city of Chicago. So that's an uh, entire city and countless number of murderers for potential trouble. Hmm. Uh, I, this is the only way out, so... Shit. I think we're going to have to do things the old-fashioned way. What do you think Saman's plans are? Yeah, 
I have a Ooh, that smoke looks terrible for some reason. It just doesn't work at all. Is there a security computer somewhere? Have the bio energy to do anything. That's not all that useful. What the hell is that? Biochemistry and data. So far, I'm not impressed with police explanations. I think if there's some kind of dangerous, unstable individual in this game, she's the one. Okay, we finally found it. The entrance to this madman's lair. Not long before we put an end to the father of human genetic pollution himself. Unworthy to purity. I hope she does realize that they intend to kill her too. That's the only logical conclusion you could come up with. Okay, finally we've located J.C. Denton's base. The sanctuary itself appears to have no active defenses, but the floor is, the door is immovable and impenetrable. We will step up our attempts on the leading attention. Well, the healing still takes a lot of energy, but at least it's very rapid in days. I, I, I'm not sure if it's worth it, though. In many ways it seemed to be better when it was slower. That's sort of odd. That's probably me imagining things. But I think it's it's the efficiency is not all that much different, but what is different it's 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 fast acting. Um, we don't really need those. On the other hand, we don't need these either. Okay, it seems that only Billy Adams can use the gate from Trier to Antarctica. We suspect it's key to their DNA, perhaps intended for Paul Denton originally. We are sending a detachment to neutralize JC. For her service, Adams will be given a biomod. We've hidden it for the time being to avoid riding up the truth. So they are willing to at least tem do temporary agreements with modified soldiers, but their overall scheme is to eliminate them all. So if they gain free victory, we are all dead one way or another.
wonder if I can get corpses on top of that robot. Not much success there. Auxiliary circuit engaged. There's a survivability. Uh, I, I don't want to leave it around. Uh, explosive, so you could have shot this one when it was around here too. At least heavily damage it. And there's another security terminal here. We are quite near the captured Grey that their leader was talking about. Save the poor creature, or the Templars will vivisect him to learn about the Grey's vulnerabilities. We get a code to release this. I'll take a look around before. acting on that. Ah, screw it. What do you require? Find your way home. Find your way home. We have set up a, the, a base and completed our scouting. There's a small group of greys escaped from the abandoned Versalite base nearby. We doubt that these are the reasons for the gate or and continued search for the JC Tenton himself. Uh, going after Chasey. Ah, uh, I think I'll go after him too. Site X. Threats active. Do we have MP grenades? Now let's take a look at what we what kind of threats are here. Uh, it's our blame threat. Hmm. I wonder how a spider bot does against those. Excellent, my minion. What a hostile. Holy crap. That's a... Uh, that's a guy in a power armor. Gonna pick a fight. You're no match for a Templar. A small price for the sake of purity. Seems to only have a flamethrower. I 
went grey. Okay, our spider only s just achieved victory because it had a flamethrower. Any other weapon we would have lost. Well, the spider would have been lost. I'm sort of confused what the ending from the previous game the game decided to so It doesn't appear to be the end of the world scenario where I thought But I, I sort of assumed that because everyone's talking about a gigantic collapse And nothing in the... that's the only scenario in the first game that would lead to a collapse So... I'm guessing they re-roll basically one of the endings from the, what's been told so far, it seems like it's the AI merger ending. But instead of going as the first game seemed to imply, it didn't work out. The reason why I didn't destroy that turret is because there might be a chance to get access to the security console and reprogram them to us shoot at the enemies. But yeah, it doesn't look like to be an easy easy thing to do, so Those armors have a weak spot, but I have no idea how the hell I'm, am I going to ever shoot at that weak spot. Ooh. Maybe on him. Yeah, uh, I think we can't really afford a proper fight at this point.
this weapon is no good against them. The bot's been shut down. That's strange. It's no easy way of taking them out. Maybe if you could get a shot back, but that's not an easy. If you can kill them that way, I'd say that's a deserved kill. Uh, camera. More cameras here. Where is the security system control? There has to be some one of them here. Where is it? It's a weapon system, isn't it? shots a fairly good rate of fire uh, I don't think that's active The bigger problem is I don't think they don't seem to be dropping anything. So we can't replenish our ammunition stock. Okay. We're seeing an unusual amount of greasel activity in the area. Apparently they escaped the they escaped the Birth Life base when it was abandoned and populated this entire area. Must have been eating the penguins and living in ice buckets and caves. Be on your guard because these things are probably pretty hungry for humans at this point. Great. Okay. Where's the security control booth? Seriously. No, I just totally miss it. Well, it doesn't matter at this point. There's nothing functioning. Everything's been destroyed, so let's move on.